Hello. In this video, I'm going to explain how to connect tournaments in chess results by uh, if you have one big festival and you want to connect them in the, in the same um, chess results page, so that you will be able to see all the tournaments and not see not search for others. Like here, for example, you have all the European Chess uh, Youth Blitz Championships. We have open 14, open 16 sections, open 18 here, so that you will be able to go from one to another without uh, um, looking for them in the main page. What you need here is to create a new tournament. Let's do some just basics. Um, just, just just very very basic demonstrations let's open tournament that is going to be named connection demo one we need some very very basic facts about this tournament I'm not going to fill Anything that I do not need to fill it to fill in, just tournament name, number of rounds, uh, etc. I think this is what we practically need, and then we upload it to chess results. This is tournament number one. Now we will open another tournament. We'll, we will call it connection demo two. Okay, and again. The name is here. Just some basic facts about the tournament. You will probably, in real tournaments, you will need to, to, to fill everything in as you should, but I'm not doing this here just for the demo purposes. And we're uploading the second tournament to the chess results, to the uh, chess results uh, page. So now we go back to the demo one tournament, then we press internet, customize lists at chess results. This is going to be the key for our tournament, for connection of the tournaments. Here you can see the database key. This is the number of the tournament in the database. And you copy it from here and you put it in group. This is the new group ID. And tournament A is going to demo one is going to be the first tournament of, of the of the selection. So it's the name, so the sorting will be number one. Click save. And as you can see, the short name now is open and you call it, uh, for example, open one. Okay, and you save it again. Um, pay attention to that the, this uh, short name was not uh, editable before the first save, so you need two saves here. We'll see it. Um, when we do the same with the second tournament, so we go to demo two tournament again, again, customize list at chessresult.com. We need this database key here and pay attention that I'm not taking the database key from, from the second tournament. I'm, I'm taking the uh, database key from the first tournament. If you're going to uh, have 15 tournaments, for example, or several several tournaments, just use the database key from the first tournament, which is going to be the one that defines uh, the group. Now, the sorting within group of this tournament is going to be number two. As you can see, the short name is not editable right now. We can't, we can't change anything here. So we need to click Save. Now we're, we're able to edit it here. And we put Open B section name. So now this is done and when we go to show tournament you can see that open 1 and open B tournaments are connected now. We can go from one to another uh, with just one click. Hope you enjoyed the video. I would appreciate a like and see you in another one. Thank you very much.